common problem when curling hair is that sometimes you'll curl the hair and the curls will fall all the way to the bottom. So one way to actually fix that is curling the hair from the top and then working your way down. So again, you wanna make sure you start from the top and then work your way down. You wanna make sure you're distributing that heat evenly throughout the entire strand of hair. And by making sure you distribute heat evenly, you're gonna get consistent curls throughout. And don't tug too hard on the curl, otherwise you'll straighten or loosen some of it. And that's how you get consistent curls. A thing I hear a lot is people have a hard time getting the same curl pattern on both sides of the hair when they're styling their hair themselves. So I wanna give you a couple tips on how to achieve that. First, what you wanna make sure is that on either side, you're curling the hair away from the face. So sometimes with body positioning on one side, it'll be super easy and it'll feel natural and you can keep going away from the face. And then you switch up the body positioning and that can feel really uncomfortable and you end up doing this side towards the face, which will give you a completely different curl pattern and definitely not what you're looking for. Another thing that's very important is you wanna make sure that the curls start at the same spot. So let's say I'm curling my hair on this side. I wanna line it up where my eyes opening is usually where I like to start. And this is how I personally hold it, especially because there's the Sarah gloss plates, so I know I'm not gonna get crease marks. And then I'm able to just get a nice curl here. And then on the other side, I just wanna make sure we're lined up with the eye as well. And then that way you can see you get the same curl on either side.